navigate to the site jetbrains.com slash toolbox dash app and download the app based on your operating system and processor architecture. I will be downloading the Linux x86 tar file since I'm using Ubuntu 24.04 on an x86 processor. After downloading, click on System Requirements to view the necessary packages needed to run the JetBrains Toolbox app. While newer versions of Windows or macOS do not require any additional dependencies, for Linux, we need to install the following packages. Copy the required packages and install them using the Ubuntu Package Manager. Extract the downloaded tar file and run the JetBrains app. It will take a few seconds to start up. Once it has started, simply follow the on-screen instructions to complete the setup. Now we can install and manage all JetBrains IDEs from the Toolbox app. To demonstrate, let's install the IntelliJ Community Edition IDE. Search for IntelliJ and click on Install for the Community Edition IDE. Now, the Toolbox app will download and install the latest version of the selected IDE. This may take some time depending on your network speed. Let's open the installed IDE by double-clicking on it and complete the initial setup by following the on-screen instructions. Click on New Project to create a Kotlin project. Enter your project's name, select Kotlin as the project type, and then choose the build system. For this demo, I'll opt for Gretel. Since Gretel doesn't support JDK version 22 at the time of this recording, I'm selecting version 21. Finally, click Create. Now IntelliJ will create a simple Kotlin project and initiate the Gretel build. This process may take a while depending on your network speed, as Gretel will download all the dependencies required to run the program. Once it finishes, you can either click the Run button at the top of the IDE or press Shift plus F10. This will execute the program and display the results in the integrated console at the bottom of the IDE. That's it! Thanks for watching and see you in the next one!